What's up, guys? Robwood on the mic. I don't know why it says winner's quarterfinals. It's definitely not winner's quarters. Unless it's just that small of a bracket. Maybe it is. Um, but uh, probably about somewhere in the teens today. And uh, we have he, he, I'm going to assume by the in-game tag that it's 24 Hijo or maybe he ho versus uh, Playground, which uh, has incorrect, um, intentionally incorrect capitalization. Ooh, there we go. See, those little uh, Regal Blasts uh, co ladder combos look really cool, and they feel annoying to get hit by, and then you're like, oh, I just took 19%. I'm, I'm all right. We're good. That up there's got to be the worst up there in the game. I'd rather have Little Max. Okay, so... Not a lot of damage taken by Playground so far in the first uh, in the first part of this game, despite uh, Hijo losing the first stock there. I just it's just Pit is just so much more well-rounded of a character than, than Banjo, I, especially with the reflectors and the speed that they bring. I I'm not sure what Banjo is supposed to do in this matchup. But maybe we'll see. I saw Hijo um, practicing their, uh, their I guess, Ness Edge Guards, actually. So like most uh, Banjo players, you pretty much have to be a Lab Monster. And they definitely called out the, the anti-mash there. And uh, Erner keeping things relatively competitive now. That was actually a good idea, because even if the uh, jab kept going, the Wonder Wing was going to uh, was gonna have something to say about it. That and all of a sudden Hijo, huge bit of momentum here. And uh, only taking like twenty percent to the, like the ninety that they've done to playground, almost taking the second stock there. We have the grenades uh, providing a little bit of uh, of fire and forget ledge pressure, letting Banjo cover the other options. Now we're looking for the wolf up tilt. That's there is there it is right there. But I guess a grab works just as well. Playground shaking their head. I'm not sure what they expected. I guess they expected the grenade to not explode and like to get bounced back at Banjo. And now rapid fire beak thrusts coming through. Now, that up air may be really underwhelming, but at least it's big. It's kind of like a little Palutena up air, but it doesn't really do anything when you get when you get hit by it, though. But it can at least beat out some uh, some landing options. I like that. Nice little Duck Hunt-esque combos coming out. And they tried to go for a Wonder Wing there and didn't have one. So um, I think Banjo is probably the only character that has an expendable resource that you actually can't see. Um, like a, like a, that you can't see on the, on the character portrait. There's no like little Wonder Wing fl uh, feathers um, on the, uh, above the character portrait, so. We got a spot dodge habit coming out, but so far it's working out for Hijo until Playground gets privy to it. We'll see if that happens. Uh, it goes for the forward air read again, no dice. Playground sticking in there. Oh, nice, actually. Staying at that Wonder Wing distance, but keeping shield ready to go. Never mind. That was pretty much a, a call out on the arrow there. <laughs> nice replay. <laughs> yeah, that'll that'll eat through it. That'll eat through it. I remember we thought that move was good. I mean, Wonder Wing is fine and all. But I remember when we were like, bro, this is so dumb. We didn't just wonder we I think it's because um, it was pretty close to like lockdown time at that point. And um, most people's Wonder Wing experience comes from online where it's unreactable and stupid. Online, it's just kind of like a strong, like, <laughs> I don't know, Sonic spin dash that you can't cancel. I don't know. It's like it's like a invincible Wario bike or a 
and then and then minecart came out, and then Steve minecart Steve minecart came out, and we're like, what if we made this a projectile that also bear, uh, puts you in a buried state while you move, and also if it's gold, it has it's stronger than Wonder Wing, and it's faster and it's more unreactable and it has armor, just like Wonder Wing, and then you know, the rest is history. So Playground is going to, um, despite how like Playground basically had the entire first stock to himself, despite that. Hey Joe, the pendulum definitely swung around the second stock, and uh, they have a much better handle on things now. Uh, still keeping a lead in the beginning of this game. And unless uh, Playground can get the pendulum to swing again, I don't know. Oh, Jesus. Drop the phone. <laughs> Okay. Now they don't have a they don't have the jump, but if even if you don't get the edge guard, if you can w make them waste their wonder wings, that's one less offensive option that you don't have to deal with, and it also means that you don't have to cover the the uh, horizontal. You can basically treat it like Kazuya, where you do, don't have to cover the uh, the horizontal recovery anymore. You can just go out there and smack them. Boom. That was funny. Why did he keep throwing it? <laughs> At that point, uh, toss it the other way, see if he can punish. But, you know, the amount of times I've seen people throw stuff at uh, bounce heroes, sometimes you just get in that muscle memory. All right, Playground with a lead, similar to last game, but I don't know, barely breaking out of that berry. What a weird world where Banjo is the worst rare character in this game. In a game that has K. Rule, Diddy Kong, and Donkey Kong, Banjo is the worst one. I never would have thought that. Anyway. Is that up throw? I can't even tell. I'm not sure why he's going this far out, but he's going to have to burn a Wonder Wing to come back. Or he can blow himself up. That also works. You still have to Wonder Wing back. So all that, all those extra steps, and you just get smacked anyway. I, okay. It was cool. It was cool to watch, though. Like, mo like most Banjo stuff, it was really cool looking, but it didn't really help. So <laughs> anyway, Playground in a much better spot this time. But, I mean, they kind of flubbed the lead in the first game anyway, and the Wonder Wing will take it. But at least... You can take solace in the fact that that's one less Wonder Wing they can use here in the last stock situation. Imagine if they rolled over like you didn't use the five in the first stock before you died, and you get... <laughs> you didn't use them for the first two stocks, and you have 15 to use in the last. Mmm, triple up air. That's a solid, like, 10 damage. I'll curve this knock down a little bit. Benjo's really fun to watch. And if Hijo's making him work, he's making him work. And right now, I feel like these Wonder Wings are like nine for 10 in terms of, uh, is that the punish? Okay, we're out of Wonder Wing, guys. We're out of Wonder Wing. Last stock. There's gonna be a lot of double jumping coming out. But really? Interesting little dodge there. Nice little forward air off the pickup on the berry. That's what? Get out of there. You better start mashing right now, Playground. Ooh, at least he didn't die. At 150-ish percent and gets smacked again in Playground. Or rather, Hijo takes that 1-2-0 oh over Playground. Go, huh?